we'll do the M.2 next. Ooh. As everyone knows, we do have our aesthetic cords on also. I'm the, I'm the bad guy. I don't. Yeah. Don't do what I do. He doesn't have his. Don't do what I do. So we'll find the magic mini screw that goes in place up here. In our last video, if you remember us talking about the, uh, the M.2, these do come in multiple sizes and lengths. They're not always going to be that same size. Some are a little bit fatter and a little bit longer. They all relatively work the same. And it's just trying to find a little mini screw inside here that goes to that. That's the hard part. See, this is what we do. Mason Dog, we're all about teamwork. We help each other out. I love it. So make sure that slot, lined up that slot that's inside there. Mm -hmm. So Push you can go in everything you clicks, basically. Push it, it down. Case. For sure. I know my hands are in the way of this, but it is really no easy way of doing this. And this, you do not want to crank down. Once it gets a little tight, that's it. Done. All right, what's the uh, next, next part? We're ready to put it inside the, uh, inside here now. So it's going to be stuff out the way. And this tower is already set up for a micro ATX board, which is perfect. Make our job a little easier. We're done about moving on stands. Screws. Uh, we are gonna put some stands inside here. Stand there, stand there. That's gotta stand, that's gotta stand. Those all got stands. So we need to stand here, stand here, stand there. So three stands. I wish there was an easier way to do these. I wonder if this will slide in. One of these actually. No, it will not. So we had. One. So, you have any questions so far? It's kind of cool how the uh, parts come together, right? Yeah. Stand here. Well, it's not needed there. So, let's take it right here. Is up. Very nice. Tighten these ones up. Tighten that one up. That should match all of them. <clears throat> Look at the board upside down. There we go. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, bam. Bam. Bam, bam, perfect. Oh, in there. Before you put it in there. Here, I'll hold this for you. So you see that this, you get, they had a stand oh, right okay. there. So we moved that stand from there to there because we didn't need that one. Because these two correspond with these two right here. Oh, and that, that was a three? One, two, three? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. And all we do is make sure it lines back up down here. You want, you want to get this shot over here? And that way they can see what that is for when it comes in. Pull back out a little bit. Yeah. So that's what you see on the back of your yeah. PC. Okay. That's yep. what the motherboard is when it's, wow. when it's uh, connected to the PC. Yep. Cool. All right, so next we're going to mount the actual motherboard to the tower the chassis as i call it there were screws right here they just correspond with each holes either grounds on each top of all these screw holes uh, provide a ground for the motherboard also in correlation with the grounds that are built into the wires already Ooh, almost. <coughs> oh, me. mitchell you were right that's the right ones Work. Here, I'll separate them for you, just in case. You get some coarse red ones and some fine threads. The coarse red, we don't need fine threads, one we need. And 
and these you just want to smell. You do not want to overly tighten these screws. You risk damaging the motherboard that way. You damage the motherboard. You gotta buy another you one. Go all the way back to step one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's that's yeah. You gotta take all the stuff out and go buy another one. Yeah, <laughs> see fine. if you can get a return. <laughs> yeah, sometimes we'll let you do uh, RMAs. Um, not all of them though. Put last screw in. Sure, we're almost done. Whoops. 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 Make room for the video card to go in. That's the rear? Yeah, you can just snap it on. It covers the whole the whole thing. Okay. So I'm doing one time. I mean, yeah, we're like good. 45 minutes. Yeah, we're good. So we'll pop these out. For the video card to go in. And this right here, we'll just take this off. Well, here, here, hold on, hold on. Let her do it. Get a little hands, hands on. So what all am I taking off this? Yeah. What else? We'll take that off. So that is your PC IE. It goes in like that, right? Uh, this is will, getting plugged in, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Dennis will uh, walk you through it. Great job, team. Ooh, wow. And then this, this right here, mm -hmm. with a slide right in here. And your actual it goes ports. Inside, yeah. right? Yeah, just like this. You put it like this. Oh. Line these up with one of these. Give me that one right there. But you're gonna use both hands and, and watch this right here. Cause this this little little <coughs> slot right here, you're gonna hook into that. And then once you push it down, this will pop up and hold it in place. Yeah, you can go ahead and do that first thing. You don't wanna do it? I don't wanna break uh, anything. I'll line it up for you. Okay. You don't have to you don't wanna do it. You don't feel comfortable. Oh, we gotta take this back plate off real quick. It's in the way. What this? This right here. Oh. Yeah. We'll put that back on after we're done. So you can put it in any one, or it has to go in this one. So it's a dual slot. So it'll take up this slot and this slot right here. I moved this one out of the way so we can make sure it's lined up perfectly. Can I take that and slide it back in there now? So this this top around. right here is going to rest right up there. So like this? Yep. I see IT in your field, in your future. Uh, is that little thing supposed to go in there right there? You got to make sure the whole thing is lined up with that bar. Oh, man. What is that? Yeah, it's 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 a little tough uh, from the down angle, especially oh. the first time. Uh oh, Let's I see. don't know. I heard something. I'm scared. Ah, uh, hold on, hold on. Oh, she's in. You got it. Oh, that's she's it. it. Yeah. Oh. It just Woo! everything's oh. new. Yeah, no. <laughs> hey, I know what you're talking about. I'm yeah. that crunchy. I'm, I'm like, whoa. Like, whoa. Like, everything, everything's like, new. So uh, kind of uh, cringy the there. The inside there have never been used, <laughs> open and closed. So that you yeah, you can smell, them. but it's like, I don't know the how to explain it. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Okay. So all that silicone and whatever else they got in there. Mm-hmm. Outstanding. All right, so we got to screw that back on, right? Yeah, this will go. One of these ways to go around. There we go. Yeah, we'll do yeah I like that bar. It saves time. Screw you don't have to first. screw down each individual. Well, I, I can't get over how you can extend this out and make it so much easier. Mm -hmm. It does. I do like that a lot. And then line this, line these holes up, it's pretty straightforward. Take that screw. 
this screw. When we finish, it's gonna sit this way. Like it's gonna be the bottom. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah, it'll, it'll stand up. Put our last one back in. This screw, and that's the last one. That's what we're gonna do. <clears throat> and that is it. Hold on, let me let me do the hard part. I gotta do the hard part real quick. You know, as, as the as the CEO, I gotta do the hard part. <laughs> What's the hard part? Yeah, here, here's the hard part, man. This is the worst part of the build. <laughs> gotta connect these two right here. See? So hard. <laughs> so hard. So hard. And go. what is that? <laughs> that's the Wi-Fi. I'm just joking. I say, is that the Wi-Fi? Yeah, that's the oh, Wi-Fi. Right. Yeah, that's the Wi-Fi. All right, now that we have everything in place, the video card, the RAM, the uh, the, the CPU, the uh, M.2 SSD RAM, it's all in place. Next step is the wiring. It's the easiest part, me being a cable management freak, I got to have it looking nice. Yep. So right now we'll, do, we'll route all the cables. Everything's basically sitting out here already. Got your front fan, your rear fan. They'll plug in the different headers on here. Everything kind of is self-explanatory for the most part just by looking at the ends of the cables where they would go. I mean, obviously this is not gonna plug in here. It does not, does not fit. That looks like it, that's gonna plug in there. So that's what we'll do next. This is for the front ports for your USB and your uh, Microphone and headphone jack up front. It just plugs in to the motherboard, pops in, and that's it. Once we flip the tower up and get everything plugged in, we'll start you know, routing the cables to where everything looks nice and it looks good. Next, we're gonna do the, the GPU. This is the eight pin. Some video cards only have a six pin. We'll take the six pin, with the provided adapter right here and make it an eight pin. And that's just gonna pop right in there. And that's it. Bam, shablam. Next is gonna be the motherboard power. Put that on there, flip it around. And it's the same type of adapter, just like you did same, with the Yeah, exact same power. adapter style. Cause some of the yeah. uh, other motherboards don't have the multiple plugs on them. Yeah. That's it. And that's why you also want to make sure your motherboard is level because just like how you had to push that in, you mm -hmm. don't want to break that. You can break your motherboard. Right exactly. There. Just trying to push that power in because it's a little tough. Next is going to be the power for the actual CPU. It's this right here. It's going to come in here. This is. <clears throat> It's so hard to see inside here. The next in. build, I think we need to do a full ATX uh, case. Next build. So there will be another build at some point yep. in the future. Last thing we have left is uh, our two uh, fans. We'll find them on the fan, the header fans. They're normally on the motherboard near the areas where they would have fans typically at. This one is going to be so uh, right now she's plugged in the, the last fan header, which are sometimes difficult to get in. They don't make it the easiest. Mm -hmm. I wish there was a better way. Yeah, I agree. Simple plug, but they've been doing this same style for years. Yep. It? And this will complete the build. Mm -hmm. Yep, slap the sides on. Is that it? Amazing. Like then you got it. Just push it down. Got it in there? Oh. Okay. Woo woo! I'm scared. Whoa! Oh, yeah, we scared. did it. And that is it. Amazing. Alright. Slap this Put little on there. magnet filter. I was like, that's a magnet? It's magnet. Yep, yep. It's it magnet. It really easy to clean with a yeah. yep. You just take it off. That catches all the it. dust, right? Yep, yeah. catches all the yeah, dust. You got a good it. portion of it. Yep. Not all of it. Though. Not all of it, but yeah, a good portion. So we'll all take right. our cables that we have really weirdly strung out up here. Let's pull them back a little bit. 
<clears throat> Take the provided straps. There you go. There you go, sir. Right here. Yep. Sweet. You can use the straps. Some give them straps, some don't. You have small zip ties. Those will work also. You just do not want to tighten them too much because then they will end up cutting the wires and you do not want cut wires. Cut wires, could be fire, electricity. Yep. No bueno. So we'll probably take a zip tie that they have on yeah, the back zip over tie here. Yeah, zip tie Zip tie, push up through this. And the, the good thing about the uh, cable management is it helps, uh, you know, allow good airflow. Uh, because what happens is the cables actually get all in the way of the fans and it messes up the airflow, which uh, doesn't allow the, the PC to cool properly. Uh, do we have, okay, you got your knife. Cool. I would not recommend using a knife, use a pair of scissors yeah. or a pair of uh, snips. Do not do this at home. Yeah. <laughs> I've been doing it like this do not for do what a very we long do. time. Do not do what we do. So we'll put the uh, put the cases back on the slides on, and this bad boy is done. We'll get an OS put on it. Get that taken care of. Sweet. I love this tempered glass. Yeah, yeah I was like, so this nice. is a good one. And everyone, you know, expects a tower like this or a system like this to be overly priced. So how much did you pay? Uh, we, we have, um, I think, I think it's like, it's like $1,300. Yeah, it was, in, yeah, in it was about 1300 uh, on the, on the build for and the, you, for the parts. You can definitely build this for a lot cheaper. Yeah. A lot cheaper. You can go with. And you can go a lot higher too. You can go a lot higher. <laughs> you can go like five grand. My, my video card alone is double the price of this system, which is overpriced. But there you go. That's it. This is our tower. It's done. Everything's in. Do the honors for another one. Woo! Uh, and there she there is. There we go. She's complete. Good to go. Should we uh, turn her on? I think we should turn, like, it turn it on. We can get that, uh, get that power for it real quick. Right. Somewhere. Let's turn this bad boy on. I feel like he's cutting the circulation off of my implement. So we don't have a uh, operating system uh, installed, but we're gonna plug it up just to make sure it's working by seeing the BIOS. So we should see the BIOS when we uh, plug it up. All right guys, so excited. Mitchell here, we got Kennedy, we got Dennis. Dennis did a great job, amazing job, getting this computer built. We don't know if it's gonna work. We have no idea. And you know we're so excited to um, see what's gonna happen. So once again, uh, thank you so much for watching the videos. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe, and leave comments. Kennedy, you want to go ahead and do the honors, and let's get this thing let's cooking. See. Oh, please, Park, don't embarrass us. Okay, we got power. Okay. Okay. Let's see though. Hold up. Uh oh. Uh oh. oh. Into the bios. Hold up. Let's see. Bam. Oh. Perfect. All right. Oh, it shows yeah. you. Yeah. Chassis fans right here spanning at 900. So go. this is how you can tell what's yep. going on. This is how you can see everything. Now, this is what you call the bios or the UEFI bios. Tech and versions of everything. Yep. So this, everything this is the bare bones of what you can see. Yes, well. it, it has not blown up. It's not smoking, so we're good to go. Yes. Now, the only thing we're missing is, as you can see, it shows the uh, M.2 uh, hard drive. We just need to upload the operating system. Yep. And that can be Windows 10, Windows 11. You know, if you want to put Windows 7. Linux. Yeah, whatever you want to put onto the machine. So we don't have the operating system, but this is a functional Computer, you can game on this computer once you get the operating system set up. Sure. So, hey, outstanding, my brother. Outstanding. 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 Outstanding, camera guy. <laughs> yes. 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 Outstanding, yes. Jay. <laughs> our, our marketing manager. Thank you so much, sir. All right. Oh, well, like awesome. I said, we're going to do another video. We're going to be doing more builds, bigger, better, more fun. 
And uh, once again, thank you so much. You couldn't have done it without our team here. Uh, Mason Dog Academy of Technologies. Like, comment, subscribe. Right. <laughs>